IQ scores have been drifting up about three points per decade. This is not a personal effect. This is a cohort effect. Mm -hmm. Well, it's not for an individual, but the world. What, what, how do you explain? So what's the explanation? And, and this has presented intelligence researchers with a great mystery. Two questions. First, is it effect on the 50% of the variance that's the G factor or on the other 50%? Mm -hmm. And there's evidence that it is a G factor effect. And second, what on earth causes this? And doesn't this mean intelligence and G-factor cannot be genetic mm -hmm. because the scale of natural selection is much, much longer than a couple of decades ago? But certainly it can be the Flynn effect can affect the non-genetic aspects of intelligence because genes account for maybe 50% of the variance. Uh, maybe higher, it could be as high as 80% for adults, but let's just say 50% for discussion. I think people who specialize in this area of trying to understand the Flynn effect uh, are coming to the view based on data that it has to do with advances in nutrition and healthcare. Um, and there's also evidence that the effect is slowing down and possibly reversing. Oh boy.